Hello, this video will demonstrate how to import a audio CD into your iTunes and then sync it with your Mirage Media Server. First, we need the Mirage Media Sync software. Open up a web browser and type in the IP address of your Mirage Media Server followed by forward slash config forward slash software dot ASPX. That'll take you to a page like this where you'll be able to see both links for Windows and Mac versions of your Mirage Media Sync software. Download the appropriate uh, version and then run it and when you open it up you'll see a program like this. And this is the Mirage Media Sync software. Um, the first tab shows the current status followed by the additional tabs where you can sync various different kinds of, of uh, media. The one we're going to be looking at today is the iTunes tab. You click on that tab and then check off the automatically update iTunes music box and that's all that there is to it. Oh, then also select your server from this drop down in the upper right hand corner here. You just have to apply all that and then from then on the MediaSync software will automatically be running down here in your uh, toolbar. Um, whenever the computer starts, it'll be down here. Uh, anytime that if it would fail to start, then you just start it from your start all programs uh, like you would anything else. Uh, next, open up iTunes and import a CD like you would normally do. I have one here that'll boot up in a second. iTunes should ask you if you automatically if you want to import the CD. Hit yes. We'll let that import and I will check back in when it's almost done. Okay, as you can see, our CD is just about to finish importing. And I have my MediaSync software up here. You won't have to have this running uh, it, where you can view it. It'll automatically happen in the background. And you'll see the sync pending here. It's constantly monitoring my iTunes folder. And down here below that, you can see the history of all the other music that uh, it has synced already with the iTunes folder. It's calculating. There you go. And there you go. It has finished the sync. And you'll see as you scroll down here. Petty and Wallflowers is now part of the uh, Mirage Media server. And that's all there is to it.